Hey, what's up everybody? I'm 19, my name's Tristan, and I wish I would have started these videos a long period of time ago, like started this channel and stuff, uh, but I didn't. But now I'm 19, I thought, what's a better time? I thought, okay, well, I wanna start it when I graduate high school or when I start making money online or when I um, do a certain amount of sales or whatever. But I think this is, what's a better time than to just start when I just turning 18, this is my last teen years. Um, showing what I'm gonna do, what I've been doing, how I'm at, where I'm at right now, um, how I was able to get to this point. Um, that sounds in the way. Yeah, that's a crazy view. Um, but yeah, I'm 19 now. Um, how I was able to get in this place um, and do the things I wanna do and be able to do the things I wanna do further. So. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to start out with just like uh, a tour of like my place, how I kind of a backstory of how I kind of got where I'm at right now. And then I'll get into what my goals are for this year, what I want to do. I want to start a vlog where I can just like talk to the camera, show what I'm doing, kind of like a, a I don't know, what's a good word for it? Just like a journal. But I, I journal like writing, but I think getting it out in word form and then um, showing people. Also, I wish when I started, I could see something that gets some relation to what I want to do. Because I knew I didn't want to go to college. I know a lot of people are in the same situation. They don't know what to do. And I want to give some uh, some guidance and like some show, show my path. Because I'm not saying I know everything. I, I'm still learning. Um, I'm just at the start of what I want to do. But I think that it would help a lot of people. Um, from where I was at, because I wish I had something that I could watch, like go back to see somebody else's path, have some motivation that way. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get right into um, what that looks like, peace. So some backstory about me, I graduated high school. I knew I never really wanted to um, go to college, further my education. Like I, I wanna learn more, but like school wasn't for me. And the thing that with that um, is, I was gonna go to a trade school, was gonna go weld, my brother had welded before, um, and I was just gonna follow that path and just go down the labor route, because that's what I've always done since I was a kid. It's just labor, um, do hard work. That's, that's, what I, that's what I've always done. But I knew that that wasn't like long-term what I wanted to do. And yeah, I, I, I couldn't do that. So what I did was I, I tried to get into marketing. I tried, I was working like a, a lifeguard job as well. Um, I applied to be a welder at this place. I got the job, I came home, I called him up. I said, I can't do it. Um, and then I went all into marketing and I don't know if it was all in, I, I tried for a while and I didn't see really any results. And I was just trying to get like an intro job, something um to be able to like learn as much as possible be able to freelance myself or do something but i couldn't find a, an exact path to take and somehow i was applying for like sales reps jobs i guess and stumbled across somebody sent me some free training and it turned out to be a program they all sold me to a program like i hopped on the phone with a student named brendan and yeah paid a lot of money <laughs> uh and i went all into this program and I'm glad I did because going all into something, I, I it took me a long time to see results. Um, a lot longer, I saw, like so many other people, like they see results, they don't see results within like a week or two weeks or three weeks of just dedicating yourself to something or even months. And then they give up because they don't see results. And they didn't know the next day they would have seen results or the next week or the next month, they would have just kept on going, they would have seen results. And I kept on going, uh, even like lack of motivation. They want to do this stuff. Um, Cause it wasn't something I was good at either is talking to people and um, social skills and stuff. It wasn't really there for me. So that's what I lacked and I was improving. Um, and one day I got my first close and I closed a hundred dollar outbound cider package and changed my life. <laughs> the next day, I did two three thousand dollar deals um, in just one day, and it just rocketed off after that. I went after that day. I went. I was lifeguarding for this uh, the YMCA for two years. I went, quit my job, 
um, and just went all into this. But ever since, I never felt like I was fully all in, if that makes sense. Like I was all in, but like it was, it wasn't, it, it didn't feel like I was all in. I was still comfortable. Um, I was actually able to go to Miami for a month, last month, uh, meet some awesome people, do like, th that was a crazy experience. And I, um, I'm super grateful for that. That's something crazy I was able to do with this. And things just move really fast. But I still didn't feel like I got back and I just felt like I wasn't all in and I had to get some own space because shit, my room was, I, I was working and sleeping in the same room. I didn't have a lot of space. I, I was not super happy and I wasn't doing the things. It, I was doing what I wanted to do and I was putting the work, but it wasn't where I wanted to be. And I wasn't in that situation. I wasn't fully, fully all in. So I wanted to get my own space. I found this place. Um, and I'm glad I did because this is now, now I'm actually all in. And I took the step, I took the jump, um, just like I did at the beginning and to it pay, it's paying off. So, um, I'm 19 now. This is basically the start. I haven't even spent a lot of time here, but yeah, I'll give a tour of my place. That's kind of my background where I'm at right now. I'm currently still working on the offer. I'm closing, trying to work on my skills. Because skills, developing a skill is the most important thing for me, is learning. I don't care about the money really right now because I know in the future it'll come. It doesn't matter um, necessarily right now. Um, but like in 10 years, like the skills I know and the knowledge I have is going to be way more valuable than having a, a couple bucks now. Um, so it's not about fast money, it's about long term long term vision for me. So this is what I, uh, I'm working with now. Um, this is my place. I moved in about, I don't know, I think a week ago. Um, but this is the view. It's pretty nice. I live in Fargo, North Dakota. I don't, you guys probably know, don't know where the hell that is. It's a nice little river down there. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty nice place. See, there's my birthday present couch desk this is where the work gets done um kitchen and yeah it's a pretty dope place i mean i'm i'm i was 18 i'm 19 um being able to live in a place like this going from what my room used to look like um my closet is bigger than my room that i was living in my actual closet is bigger than my room which is fucking insane but yeah um Hard work does pay off, and I'm thankful, I'm grateful. Uh, but yeah, this is what the place looks like. It's enough for me to get what I want to get done. So, I don't know that's old, but uh, yeah, this is, this is what it's looking like, I'm 19. And this is no money from my parents or anything. This is all money I've made from in the past four months. I've been in this for four months. I started making money after a month doing this. I didn't make any money my first month. And yeah, now this is what I have four months later. And I'm able to comfortably live in this place. Um, it's more than, I don't know. <laughs> I, my parents thought I should pay for a first place. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's a big step from going from a room smaller, like just everything. Imagine all this stuff, like all my desk and all that stuff in a room smaller than this. And I lived in it for 18 years. Well, I lived in it for like four years cause I had to share a room, um, when I was just growing up, but yeah, my bed's messy, but yeah, this is what I'm living with right now. And that's my view. I wanted someplace. I paid for more of the view. I don't really care about like the, the stuff. I like the view more and I like nature. Um, so I can go walking around and stuff till it snows because it gets cold as shit here. But um, yeah, that's what I'm working with right now. I'm gonna say a little bit about my goals and what this year is gonna look like for me. So yes. So yeah, this year, my main goal, um, I have three, I have three things I want to focus on. Number one is health, my body. I'll pop up a picture of what I look like in like end of track season, like when I was working out every single day, like 
that's what I looked like um, like five months ago, six months ago, I don't know. Um, and then I'll pop a picture of what the reason I have health is number one is um, of what I look like. This was in Miami. I was like eating like shit. Maybe it's a bad picture. I don't fucking know, but I hate it. So I'll pop up that picture. Um, I'm not insecure or any shit, but like this is what I look like now. I've been eating good. I've been working out and stuff. Um, and yeah, those are that's like my that's my main thing is health. Um, that's always been a huge thing for me is like working out all that stuff being healthy because your body is your fortress so that's number one health is number one obviously business uh, sales learning my skills developing my skills I want to get at least like two or three hours of learning in each day because that's the most important part for me is learning right now um, obviously like the work is great that's how I make money but like you, you learn by doing I know that but like learning actually learning um, that's just learning on top of it. Learning by doing is actually on top of it, but learning like watching videos, listening to podcasts, I can definitely get two hours a day um, easily in of doing that. Um, learning, developing my skill set, that's number two for me. And then I would say number three is making these videos. Honestly, I want to get better. Like that's another skill, I guess, is um, documenting this, documenting where I, where I am, where I want to be, holding myself accountable, and then actually reaching the goals because that's the well, number one thing is um, accountability. I guess it's not the number one thing. I have like three things. I don't know what order they go in. I think health is just going to be number one. And then this is like, I want one thing to focus on. Like if I have less things to focus on, that's so much easier for me. I know like I can work out like twice a day, like just like go for a walk and stuff like that. Um, and that doesn't take up too much of my time because I got a gym here and stuff. So, um, if I can focus on just minimal things, um, have a routine, wake up early, go to bed early, um, that's that's the goal is to just have a good life, do the things I want to do. This year I want to travel, I want to go um, do some stuff. I know like I wanted to get a place that's like not crazy expensive so I can just like leave it, not have to worry, just pay, whatever. Um, so yeah, this isn't bad, but uh, yeah, I want to be able to travel, go do other stuff as well. Um, I'm not, I don't have a lot of stuff. I'm able to just drop things and then just go do what I want to do. I'm pretty good at making rash decisions. Uh, Cause I left, left and dropped everything, went to Miami for a month with like a less than a week's note, or I guess a week's notice, I don't know how long it was, but yeah, that's also a thing is traveling. And yeah, those are, those are basically, basically my goals for 19 how I want to live out the rest of my, my teenage years. Um, and then twenties is just, I don't know, I'll figure it out as I go, but I'm not, I'm very short term. I mean, I'm long term vision, but I don't plan out for the long term. Like I, I plan out for the short term. Like I'm not worried about that. I'm doing what I'm doing right now. A lot of people are like, okay, like let's like, we're planning a trip like next summer or do some shit. Like, bro, I'll figure out what's happening next week. Like, I don't even know, like, what's gonna happen, like the next three days, that's what I'm focused on, like that's what I'm gonna get done, because things just pop up. But, I mean, I'm long-term vision, but short-term application, if that makes more sense. I don't know if that's the right wording, but yeah, that's that's how I am, and that's how these videos are gonna be, and yeah, I'll continue to make these. I'm not gonna edit, or I might edit, I have no idea. Um, I kind of like just like raw footage and stuff like that. So um, I think that's like content that's coming back. I heard somebody say like that that's what is being pushed a lot more now. Just like raw, raw footage, stuff like that. But I might talk a little bit more, I might go on a walk or something like that. Just show the nature, show what the building looks like around me, what, I'm, what my atmospheres look like. Because like I said, atmosphere is your whole um, thing. So yeah, let's get it. So I'm going to do a little uh, video overlay kind of voice thing. Um, but yeah, so this is my kind of like an out view of my place. I took a walk earlier. Um, it's funny, this trail, um, I walked on it or ran on it like since I was like a kid. Um, this is like the route I would take when I like ran cross country or like was practicing stuff. I'd run by this every time. The building obviously wasn't built. It was like just built last year, but... Uh, it's kind of dope. 
Um, there's like a little uh, train track thing that goes over. There's like kind of a tunnel thing. But the only thing is there's a shit ton of homeless people. So watch out for them. But um, yeah, it's pretty nice. Uh, nice night. I just wanted to take a walk, get outside. I like to at least walk once a day. Like go out for a walk or like walk on a treadmill. Uh, be outside because shit, day to day being cooped up in a place is really rough Um, I know it like sounds good all you can work remote you can do whatever you want like you make your own schedule but I mean I'm someone who likes to be outside and likes to do things and like I've always done things outside with my hands Um, and yeah that's a good ass view but um, yeah so I really need to get outside um, on daily Uh, that's why I also wanted a balcony on my place but this is Fargo, North Dakota, flat as shit, like two buildings, um, but yeah, hmm. so just a reflection on the video, uh, I thought it was a, I just made it today, I did it today as well, um, I'm gonna keep it raw footage, because that's what I like doing, also all the fucking people, um, that, I mean, I don't give a shit, like, people are going to hate on, like, the video, that's just what fucking, I've, I've expected this to happen, that's, like, my side of the building, that's what I look over, but, uh, yeah, my take on things is, basically, um, I've experienced it a little bit so far, I'm only guessing that, like, it continues to, like, grow as, like, I mean, people, people, like, reach out to me a lot more, um, And I guess I get... Like, I don't really want attention. Like, that's not something I seek for. Uh, But, like, I've noticed that a lot of more people reach out to me that I, like, thought wouldn't have, um, if that makes sense. And, well, I'm just going to make these videos do the things I want to do because that's what I'm focused on. And do the shit that I want to do. I don't give a fuck anymore. Um, I'm already this far, like, whatever. I'm just going to post this shit and do whatever I want. But... Yeah, and I gotta stop swearing as well. That's one thing I gotta work on. Sorry, mom. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna end it off pretty soon here. It ends in like a minute, so pretty good walk. This is my this is my goal. This is my first one I'm doing. And voiceover reflection of today. Got some stuff done. It's a Saturday. Um, not a ton happens on Saturdays. Some Saturdays are really good. Sometimes Saturdays aren't great. My main goal, feel good every day, do things that make me happy, continue to do the things I want to do, and get there by doing what I want to (laughs) do, manifesting. So um, I hope this provides some insight on, like, what, um, like, people, if there's people in the same position that I was in or... I'm not even, I won't even say I'm, like, uh, not holding myself on a high horse, but, like, hope this benefits somebody, gives somebody some insight or somebody some light at the end of the tunnel, because, yeah, this is what I get to do now, and I'm going to continue to do it. So, yeah. Peace.